In this video, we're taking a look at the new Pro Issue Ram 9 setup. This is unstoppable. I was outgunning every other Ram 9 user in game because this is gonna be effective at close range, medium range, as well as long ranges. The pro players have this class setup on lockdown and I have to go ahead and let you guys know about it. So if you guys enjoy, feel free, drop a like on the video, subscribe to the channel, turn those post notifications. I dropped a nuke with this and I know for a fact, 110%, Y'all can too. All right, let's take a look at the new Pro Player Ram 9 class setup. Don't knock it till you try it. This is unstoppable. The funny thing about it is I was playing against another player running a Pro Ram 9, but not the proper class setup, nuked his ass. Now for the first attack, we are trying out a different muzzle. We're rocking the true, I, I can't even pronounce this, true betchet break, tree that shit break, whatever, it's amazing, improving that gun kick control as well as recoil control here. Definitely a great attachment on the Ram 9. The cons are gonna be completely relevant. This is gonna be a nice SMG at any and all ranges. I was running this class setup and outgunning other players rocking similar Ram 9 builds. Give this a try. Now, we are skipping over the barrels on this build. The barrels on the Pro Issue Ram 9 are not going to be helping us out, which is a good thing because we are running a different attachment in its place that's going to be helping out additional recoil control, and that's overall a massive W. I'll trade that any day. Now, for the underbarrel, we are going to be mixing some things up. We are not going to be rocking the FTAC MSP-98 hand stop or the X10 Phantom 5 hand stop, and we're not even running the DR6 hand stop, which a lot of pro players run on some of the other SMGs. We are gonna be rocking a throwback attachment that I was pretty shocked that the pros are using. We're taking a look at the SO Skeletal Vertical Grip, which is gonna be bumping up that aim down sight speed, gun kick control, sprint of fire speed, as well as vertical recoil control. Overall, a great attachment to help us out at any and all ranges, close, medium range, long. We're gonna be outgunning everybody we see and definitely other Ram 9 users who are rocking the wrong pro player setup. Some of this stuff can get confusing. This is exactly why you had to take it from the pros and also myself because I just stole their setup. Now, we're skipping over ammunition. We're skipping over the magazine, which makes sense for a pro setup. They're not running the 40 round mag or the 50 round mag, but we are gonna be rocking a rear grip and the retort 90 grip tape is gonna be absolutely incredible, improving that firing aiming stability, gun kick control, as well as recoil control. This is mandatory in order to allow this weapon to take other assault rifle players out with ease and definitely other Ram 9 users that are not running the proper build. This thing literally has zero recoil when built right. And unfortunately, a lot of people build this weapon wrong. Now we are running a comb. This is where things get strange because normally I would never recommend running a comb, but it works out amazing on the submachine gun. The recon comb is gonna be improving that sprint to fire speed, firing aiming stability. That's gonna be huge, as well as additional aim down sight speed here. We're not only taking advantage of close and medium range, but also long range as well. The longer you hold on the trigger, the more accurate the submachine gun is gonna become, and that is why this is so unstoppable. Now, for the last attachment, we are running a stock, and that's gonna be the HVS 3.4 pad to significantly bump up that gun kick control aim idle sway more firing aiming stability as well as recoil control here definitely a nasty attachment that i stole from the pro players we're not utilizing an optic the iron sights are going to be perfectly fine because once you jump into the firing range you're going to see here that this is going to be a nasty class the ads speed is lightning quick and it doesn't move it literally has zero recoil here <laughs> what this is nasty for the man to set up, we are taking advantage of the Renetti. This is gonna be a gross secondary. We have the conversion kit, which can be transforming this into a borderline submachine gun. Honestly, better than a lot of the submachine guns. We are utilizing the 50 round drum. We have on the SO skeletal vertical grip. We have the compensated flash hider here. And we also are be rocking the good old slate reflector, making this a little bit easier to use at those longer ranges. Do not forget to equip the munitions box, scavenger gloves, covert sneakers, phone conduction headset your footsteps and gunfire a lot easier and goes to keep us off the radar and the comms vest amazing giving us a 24 7 uav every time you kill somebody run up the body 
it'll let you know exactly where everybody is at so you can keep yourself in the action and outgunning everybody that you come across this ram 9 build is the real deal i did not expect this to be as good as it was this is now my main build here in multiplayer and that's saying a lot because this is a pro issue setup so definitely use this and go crazy if you guys enjoyed feel free drop a like on the vid subscribe to the channel turn those notifications let's get in the gameplay all right let's get busy with the pro player ram 9 teammate clean him up nicely i'm really enjoying a lot of these setups with weapons that were brought back into the competitive kind of meta pool weapon pool whatever you want to oh my goodness because what happened was after this recent update they decided to open up the floodgates they brought back the bp50 the holger which i know a lot of people are upset about <laughs> look it's fun to use that competitive class in multiplayer let me tell you they didn't take it out of multiplayer so use it but now we're rocking the ram 9 which honestly this build ain't bad as well i'm running a muzzle on here that i didn't even know was in the game literally pro players are rocking it i'm checking it out right now and it's actually quite good it's another break not like the cast's break i butchering that name but it's another break for the smgs i think it's pretty much the cast is Turn around brother i think it's like the oh my god i think it's like the cast is brick equivalent for the smgs but this actually isn't bad does he have a sniper oh a bass b let me actually take this this gun got quote unquote nerfed but it'll probably be easier to, to knock him out at longer ranges with something like this he got a short barrel on here dude i'd be telling me be telling y'all man like some people they don't need to be making their own class setups they for real don't this fool got the short barrel 45 rounder on here get over here Oh no, I might die here. Yep. Okay, we completed a uh, a daily challenge that I don't even know was a thing. I really like this setup though. I'm not gonna take that Vaz B again. It's kind of mid. I will take that hoe though. I love picking up snipers. Hard point compromised. Secure the area. Does this thing is slow? Damn, bro. Visual on a Oh god. Is he gonna peek? He's probably not. Keep it moving. Hard point compromised. Secure the area. Oh, whoa, oh, oh, whoa, oh, oh, whoa, oh. whoa. Can I see him through here? I sure can. Hard point relocating. Stand by. Bro, this spot's actually busted. Holy Enemy cow. I'm just in the hills right here, too. Wait, y'all. Yo, this spot is so. This spot is not right. Dude, this spot is not right. Hold on. Please just keep funneling through here. I know for a... I don't know. Actually, I don't know. I don't want to jinx it. I don't think they can see me through this. But... Oh, 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 oh. Oh, I need to skip the... That kid needs to leave. That's, he's, that's the guy right there, too. I think. No, it's not. It's, uh... There's some other bomb hold on let me uh let me call this shit in i don't normally call stuff stuff like that in on streaks but there is a kid in here that is for the most part um ripping nice
I see him over there. Lot down here. Yo, I'm stuck on He's hitting that flank. On Where's the last guy? Yes, sir. We got him back out. <laughs> we got him. I know he's mad. He's going to rage quit. That kid's going to leave. That kid's dripping sweat gets nuked. He's going to leave. I hope he leaves. We got him. I'm glad I picked that sniper up. So glad I picked that sniper up. I hope he's gonna probably push, try to shoot my body. Ah, he got me. He threw a flash thing. I got melted, but he had a Ram 7 build. He's not running the right Ram 7 build, or the Ram 9, I should say. This is the one I picked up. This shit's gas. I need to actually probably make a sniper setup, but this shit's good. Rotate this way. so bad like I'm literally I'm literally destroying that one guy with his own gun and I dropped a nuke because I picked up his own gun oh my goodness I know he's he's probably ill but I'd be ill if that shit happened to me like imagine running a different like variation like pro setup and getting nuked by somebody rocking a similar yet yeah, better build damn I'd be ill I would not be right rotate over here I'm gonna get as many kills as possible oh shit what the Whoa, 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 whoa. I don't know what the hell happened right there. My God, this coolie guy was that Bass B. No, MCW actually. Wow. Wait, at 2.30? I'm going to call it in right now. Let's wrap it up. Just so he knows he got nuked.
Let's go. I knew we got one kill. We got two kills. Not terrible. Not terrible at all. We end up getting 71. That's a dub.